Hi everyone, Pradeep here from TGT and welcome to another watchOS update video. Today, surprisingly, Apple released watchOS 8.4.1 to the public. This update came within a week after the public release of watchOS 8.4. From the version number itself, you can guess that this one probably is an important security update rather than a feature update. This is not available for all the watches 8 supported Apple watches. This is only available for Apple Watch Series 4 to all the way up to Apple Watch Series 7, but not for Apple Watch Series 3 users. That is probably due to Apple Watch Series 3 do not require this specific security patch or maybe something else. To find the update, make sure your Apple Watch is connected to your iPhone, then open the watch app, go to general, then software update and your update should be available here but if you are already on watchOS 8.5 beta 1 then you will not see this update as you are already on a higher version than this this update came in around 64.2 megabytes in this apple watch series 5 pretty small update i was on watchOS 8.4 earlier now let's check the new build number go to settings then go to general then about and here we can see the version is 8.4.1 and the build number is 19s550 now talking about this update there are no new features in this version last week only apple released the third major update for the watchOS 8 operating system which was watchOS 8.4 this one is just a security patch over that 8.4 update as you can see, here the update description says watchOS 8.4.1 includes bug fixes for Apple Watch Series 4 and later. Talking about the bugs, Apple Watch users faced two major bugs in recent times. One is the sync issue with their iPhones and the other one is the charging issue with some specific chargers. Apple did acknowledge the charging issue and officially solved that on watchOS 8.4. But even after that update, many complained that they are facing charging issues. So it wasn't solved entirely on watchOS 8.4. Maybe watchOS 8.4.1 will do that for you. With this Apple Watch, I always use this Apple MagSafe Duo Charger and never faced any charging issue. Apple didn't mention anything about the sync issue that some of you were facing, where your Apple Watch wouldn't sync properly with the data of your iPhone but they might have done something to solve that issue as well in this update. Also, some of you were complaining that the health or rather the activity app wasn't working properly on your Apple Watch after updating to watchOS 8.4. That may be a part of sync issue that was present on watchOS 8.4. Sometime a mere reboot or repairing your Apple Watch with your iPhone solves a lot of issues. Make sure you try that. WatchOS 8.4.1 should include some important security updates as well, but if you go to the Apple security website, here Apple says this update has no published CVE entries, so we do not know what exactly were fixed, but sometime Apple resolves a lot of issues in the background and they never mention about that. Performance wise, there is no change from WatchOS 8.4 in this Apple Watch Series 5. I'm using this for more than two years now and it is still running nice and smooth just like new. The app appearance, the app performance is also fine. The activity app is working fine as well. No charging issues either. The battery life of watchOS 8.4 was good enough though battery life of watchOS 8.4.1 will take some time to report. Let's check the battery health. Let's go to settings then to battery and check the battery health and it is 81 percent after more than two years of daily usage this battery life is acceptable with this battery health and always on display i usually end my day with around 30 to 35 percent battery life left in this apple watch also you might already know apple has released this new watch face called unity lights and a new watch band as well the watch band looks really cool and is now available to order Apart from this colorful look, Unity Lights is also available in black and white color as well. Also, if you want your regular complications around it, you can do that by selecting the circular watch face just like this. Both the watch faces looks really nice. 
So if you have an Apple Watch Series 4 or newer, you should definitely update to WatchOS 8.4.1. It seems to be stable and comes with some fixes and major security updates. No new features though. We are already on WatchOS 8.5 Beta 1 and that includes some new features. We will probably see WatchOS 8.5 public release by the end of this month or early March. That's it. If you have found something else with this update, do write it down in the comment section below. Also, do mention if WatchOS 8.4.1 solves any of your existing WatchOS issues or not. Do like, share and please don't forget to subscribe to TGT. I'll see you in my next one. Peace.